just wanted to show the day kind of youth fair six uh, days after it ended uh, how the progress is going there you see the speed right there uh, racked up and ready to wheel most of the stuff it is totally gone other years it was bagged around like a week or two after sometimes even three weeks but most of it it is gone everything is basically turned poured down already uh, there's some trucks still in there but nothing the ra I racked it looks like uh, I'm gonna go make a turn here and see the inside uh, we can see inside there in the one of the parking lots so I came inside here the lot and one of the parking lots and here you see crazy miles racked the outlaw roller coaster racked over there here we see the mega drop uh, truck here racked some trailers uh, moving around here you see I think this is the remix right there some of the trailers leaving here the lot going around so we get a closer look at the other stuff it's still here we have the cliffhanger there I don't know if you caught it there the trailer was moving by uh, more of the crazy the other crazy mouth that was uh, set up here and the roller coaster trucks all there the log plume is back there I don't know if you can see it there we zoom in there's the log plume racked. Here we have, behind these Porter Johns, we have the kite flyer. Here we have the haunted house, the haunted motel. Uh, it's right still there, racked. That was the Love Bug, a Silver Streak type ride over there. Let's zoom in there. There's a trailer. They're still working on dismantling over there the uh, Sky Ride. Let's zoom in over there. But basically, the entire lot has been torn down the uh polar express is gone totally gone it was around here set up and the uh x factor those are all gone already go around this little building here over there you see bumper cars racked I'm gonna go flip around and uh, flip around and get another view of it. So this is uh, six days after uh, the fair uh, finished. Today is Saturday, April 13th. The fair ended the 7th. Here you see a couple of the log flume trucks there, right there. You zoom in there. Some of the trailers getting ready to leave. Let's go get a view from the other side. There's the outlaw, I said it earlier. Rag truck, so let's go get a view on the other side. So here through this opening in the fence here of where Kitty Lang used to be, you see the Skyride uh, truck over there, uh, which is rolling up the wire from the Skyride. So you see it goes up there. He is rolling it up. They have a, like a lift over there working, some structure workers working on the, on the pole over there. You also see there the scooter truck, which is still there. And back there, you see the construction zone, and it's still there. That's the, oh, we have another ride over there, I think we'll check it out. So here we have the Dragon Wagon, let me zoom in. Uh, just to work and it goes from there. And over there you see the workers uh, working on the uh, Sky Ride, uh, removing the wires from the pole. And then as you go that way, you see the other ones, the scooter over there, and a truck that's rolling up the wire. That's the day kind of use for has come to an end. Uh, this is six days after the youth fair uh, ended, today's April 13th. There earlier an interesting fact for us. In the first part of the video, you saw the speed over there wrecked, uh, like on the east side of the lot. The speed was 
never erected here at the fair, but they had was the Mac 3 erected uh, this year. So that was interesting that it was there. I guess they bought it, but they never put it up. Or maybe something was wrong with it. Uh, or lack of space. But uh, very excited. Uh, six days after how fast they, incredible how fast they took everything apart. Last year they were here, like I was saying earlier, about three weeks, two and a half, three weeks. They were here still uh, taking apart the stuff. Most of it was racked, but I remember the skyscraper was here like a week and a half still up. Uh, over there behind by those, those bathrooms that were set up. But everything is gone, the girl slide, the Polar Express, the, the, the big observation wheel, all gone. I know amusement rides, usually in a day they take everything apart, but usually here at the day kind of you probably usually take their time. Uh, but I guess they have a lot of other commitments and a lot of it's gone. There's some rack rides that we saw earlier, but most of it is gone from the lot. And except for the sky ride, everything has been taken apart. There's the uh, another picture of the, that. And then you see the workers over there working on the, uh, on the sky ride. Remember to like, share, and subscribe, folks. And as I turn around here, uh, looking at the parking lot uh, where we parked, remember we parked here for the three times we came to the event. Uh, just a, a glimpse. What's over there is that is part of Florida National University, uh, FIU. You can see the sign there, FIU. So everything here is Florida National University. You zoom out, it goes from over there, from 107th all the way to 112th and from 8th Street all the way over here. This is about 18th, 16th, 18th. Uh, Coral Way is, the end, is all the way back there. And then over there is the football stadium back there. Is the football stadium. And then this is all land from the park, the Miami Park where the youth first held. And toward the back they have the football fields, soccer fields, baseball fields. Uh, basketball courts, pickleball, and tennis. All back there. This is like a very big park. Uh, this side is just used for the fair and for other events. There's some. Sometimes they have some uh, Chinese uh, festivals. Uh, they also have uh, a gun show, uh, flea market sometimes, and uh, they have multiple events throughout the year uh, here. RV show. But FIU is back there on that side of the. Of the well, see you in the next one. I'll try to come back next week again to see how many of the rack rides are still here. And I'll see you in the next one.